Thompson House uh, is a new disability unit. Uh, we have a long-term facility, we have respite, we have rehab, and there are some patients who come in for uh, daycare as well. The majority of our patients at the moment are uh, acquired brain injury. We also have neurological patients who have like, uh, multiple sclerosis and Parkinson's disease or motor neuron disease. Well, I think it's just a good, good communicator. Um, when the staff are happy and at their work, they are good with their patients and make their life a, a lot more enriched and enjoyable. I've always found Edna to be really supportive. If there's anything you want to bring forward, Edna's always there for you. She's there to encourage you and support you and, you know, bring the best out on you, really. Families are very much part of uh, Thompson House and we do get to know the families really well because, you know, our patients are with us for, for quite a length of time usually, so we do get to know the families really well. Um, and yes, I do get positive feedback from them. The social aspect of Thompson House is very, very big. We have a very um, uh, large family and friends um, who come in and do barbecues and shows and take them out and Edna would be here like <laughs> she would be here way over time come back in she maybe just finished work come back in an hour later and be here till 10 o'clock at night we have a lovely sensory garden down here as well which I have been known to take a, a big black bin bag and, and head down there after work to to uh, get rid of the weeds and, and keep things like that uh, nice for our patients making time at the end of the day maybe you know before going home to sit and maybe have a talk with some of the patients and no matter how busy we are to try and sit down and make time for them and uh, and, and make them feel loved